Welcome to James R's Go! Thank you very much for joining me. Now today I'm learning how to make soap um, from the internet. Okay, so I've been trying to find the ingredients and the accessories to be able to do this with and I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing. So I'm glad you can come here and see like what a mess I'm about to make, right? I'm attempting to make soap using some uh, recipe off uh, the internet from a, another YouTuber. Ta-da! Right, okay, so you know, they gave the ingredients in ounces. I live in a world of kilograms and grams, so I had to convert the ounces to uh, um, grams, which, uh, thank you Google. And then uh, I had to recalculate the uh, grams to a quantity that I'm comfortable to fit in this bowl, because this is all I have. You know, unfortunately, I have not been able to buy a bigger bowl because of the Bangkok shutdown. You know, but luckily, you know, even with the shutdown, I managed to find this stuff and, you know, ooh, like some hearts and, uh, ooh, like animals, that's gonna be fun. But I don't think I can really jump straight in on this right away. The most important thing is that we got some safety, right? Yes, some goggles. And also some gloves, which I use to wash the car. I think this one's a bit better. Okay, all right. So yeah, they're a bit yellow. Everything's now yellow. Okay, so I think the first thing that I was going to do, I don't know, I've got some colouring here. I think this colouring and this little packet here is going to be too complicated for me to figure out right now. So I'm going to stick to some basics and I know that the very first time I make this, it's going to go completely wrong. So expect uh, a bit of a nightmare. Alright, so, ba 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 I have myself some scales over here. Unfortunately, you know, because this is the shutdown, it's just me, my camera and my friend. So we don't actually have another camera here to come over and look at what I'm doing, so you're just gonna have to stay over there, okay? It's probably safer anyway. Phone, I think this is gonna be the most important accessory here because I'm gonna look at the YouTube channel and follow it as we uh, do this. All right. First thing we're gonna measure out is the water. Water, gonna... I don't have water. When you fill up with uh, petrol in Thailand, they give you a free bottle of water. So I don't drink it, but I'll use it in the soap. <laughs> Let's see. So it does not take this. So she's doing the water first. So here water is 95.7 grams. I'm gonna put this on here. I feel like I'm at school again. So this year, after the uh, shutdowns around the world, I hope my uh, interns from France will be able to come and uh, the marketing interns got to do prospecting. Something to do with this. Does this, does this press play Nobody through? Ah, thank God for that. So we're gonna get the, uh, Caustic lye, dangerous looking stuff. Caustic soda, so it's an alkaline. And you know, alkalines can burn you. I think I'm gonna need a few more of these jars to put this in, huh? So gonna add the lye. 38.3 grams, that's a very, very small amount. Got my plastic spoon, you know, been collecting these when I get various takeouts of food and stuff. So I'm going to do a little trick. Haha. Haha. -ha. So we got a caustic soda. It's making a noise. It's like fizzing. Chopstick. You have to be careful. So that's an exothermic reaction, children. Do you know that, adults? Okay, so I just made a bit more space there. We've got to wait for that to... Uh, so we're supposed to measure out the... Uh, oil. So, since the first one is going to be a complete screw-up, we're going to use the cheapest oil. 283.5. This is the smell, right? And this is the orange color, right? I put six milliliters in, but I'm going to go for nine. I love the smell. This smells so good, so I'm going to put in quite a lot. It's actually mixing quite nicely with the oil. I, I didn't expect it to be this easy. I think there's a bit too much coloring, so it's gonna have these little specks in it. But 
maybe that might be okay. Eight thousand, nine thousand, ten thousand. I think this bell is a bit too small. Sixteen thousand, twenty thousand, eighteen thousand, nineteen thousand, twenty thousand. It looked like it's almost done. It's not quite. So this has taken a lot longer than I thought. Maybe up to half an hour. So look, we have the chance to put this on here. So maybe put it on there. So these are old shirts. Apparently we're supposed to keep it warm. It's probably good to cover it to stop the dust going in, but Thailand is hot anyway. Okay, it's been 24 hours and now we're gonna check out how the soap has done and if it's worked. Oh. A little bit soft actually. All right, let's see how this looks now. Let's try the hot soap. It's okay, it just feels a little bit uh, oily. The thing is, like, what do we put it on to let it dry? Because we do have, it's supposed to need a mat. So we're supposed to leave this for another three weeks, at least, if not longer. Okay, well that was the first attempt at making soap. It's not a complete disaster, but it's not right, so we've got to try this again. We've got to keep working at it until we can get this to, to be correct. As the Thais say, so so. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and share with your friends, and hopefully soon you can see us be successful we're making some real soap. Bye!